as much because I, you know, football and school, and I want to graduate. So, but I mean, he's improved a lot since the last time I've seen him. Like, especially. Would from you say like he's the, graduated? Yeah, no, he hasn't graduated yet. He's still got a lot to learn. He still sucks. But um, we're going to Smashville. <laughs> Jesus. Not a bad start, actually. Both the uh, characters do fantastically well on the stage. Uh, realistically, I assume, I would think, honestly, that um, like Warrior would do fantastic on a stage like this. Yeah, but um, you gotta under like you know keep in mind, Lucas has a lot of horizontal control, mm -hmm. and I think anyone that has a lot of horizontal control, you know, in Zer, Fair, Forward B. Uh, bodes well to sit underneath these platforms you know they can they have control like half the stage at a time mm -hmm. if they choose to sit under and just kind of you know do that and yeah but Mario can definitely if he's underneath the platform he can get an up tilt into a couple up airs into that's true platforms so. good good uh, tech chase situations can come from most of your up tilts I would say mm -hmm. especially since like right now like being hiding underneath that platform is probably the most excruciating thing you could do uh, uh, uh. <laughs> yep down tilt, baby. Got to mix it up a while. Sometimes Warriors will do down tilt into dash attack. Dash attack does cross up on shield sometimes when it's super close. Um, but, I mean, after the second down tilt, you can punish it with a grab. Or attack, regardless. You can do whatever, really. The move is not that impressive. It comes out frame four or five. Can't remember. You know, Chaco's trying to make some gains here on the next uh, situation. He's really trying to feel that next one out because he wants to make sure this next... Uh, advantage it that he gets is enough to close out the difference, but yeah, but that's gonna definitely do it. Dash check yeah. is super strong, and uh, you know, Lucas is a small frame. Dash check is gonna be enough to eat up most of his uh, options. Mm -hmm. Speaking of E, let him go. I love the fact that Wario's chomp heals him a little bit. You can eat the flame too, right? Yeah, you can eat the flame. Anything. My rule in Smash Four, which I did test in this game, which I'm gonna decide to say, anything that Villager can pocket, Wario can eat. Okay. So he can eat. Uh, you just don't throw it back up. Yeah. He can eat fire. He can eat PK fire. He can eat that's PK in the next patch. Oh heck yeah! If he eats the fire, if he eats a um, tree, that's broken. Should heal like thirty percent. Up tilt to waft. Oh armor! Ooh. That's a black guy. That gamer was a thing. good fart. Oh, that is black guy gamer. That was a healthy fart. That was a black guy gamer read. What are you talking about? Only black guy gamer does that. Jesus Christ! Up oh, and into the sun. That was really good convergence right there. It was Nair to into fair into. Or something. It was like in there, into snake, into rope snake, into dead. And what are we gonna see here? Mm. Mm. Head. Ooh, big head. Oh, that's damage. And just like that, they're even right there. Jesus. Chaco Taco really can just do that from one situation, can't he? <laughs> yeah. Like yeah, things are looking pretty sweet for Snorly, but Snorly, Snorly, but then all of a sudden here comes Chaco. But that back are gonna yeah. clean it, but no far at least not for the forty five seconds or so. Mm -hmm. And even so, it won't kill Lucas until he's around maybe... If Wario's at max rage, it won't kill until 65. And you're on stage. Very true. Half so that's a, still a big hill to climb, but his main focus right now, simply not dying. Yeah, don't die. I like that. That was a nice mix-up uh, Norley did right there. A little bit of a cross-up fair. He's just playing a very solid mid-range game against him. Mm-hmm. You know, as he's, like, kind of jumping around his options, he's doing a very good job of, like, knowing when to hold back in and fall back into him with an yeah. attack. It's kind of like a, 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 a movable balloon, if that makes any sense. Where it's just, like, a constant, like, one hitbox. And Norley's just, he's just really going in with these bites, dude. Like They're good they're good yeah. conditioned bites, because mm -hmm. he's putting out a lot of, yeah, like, a lot right of existence, exactly. so like, to speak. You can't just do this move off the, and he just niched him. And there? Nah. Gonna wait for the next situation. Back here, though. Not going to get the bite he wanted. Mm -hmm. Chocolate is trying to fight out of this mental deficit right now, it feels like. Mm -hmm. His down smash hasn't been getting him the kills. So now he's trying to like figure out what's his next he's attack dead. plan. He's dead. No, no, he didn't fast fall it. And just like that, we have full off. So once again. And he's just, Ooh, and every single yep. time, Chocolate's just been getting hit by grab. Looking like, for the roll. Yeah. Can and I get the forward dead. tilt? Yeah, that's mm -hmm. a two-stop. He's only playing really solid today. That's a two-stock in a situation where he just couldn't find his kill. So unless he gets an early, early kill in these in these next, like, stock or so, he's going to probably fall into the same situation where he's not figuring it out and Snorley's just not giving it to him. Yeah. 
I feel like he should probably just like at the ledge you're invincible when you get up attack. And he did not get damage up attack wasn't his once. problem at all. I know, know, but I mean like when he got caught by bite like every single time yeah, on the stage. That's true. Yeah, he could get up attack. You have invincible. Well, and wait a little longer than he is. Like he's choosing options pretty uh, frequently. Mm. It's very, uh, it's very, it's very uh, noticeable, especially for a player like Snorley who goes off of reads. Snorley is a very smart person, or a very smart guy, uh, sometimes, and um, he's not a caveman, but he realizes habits, and he's really good at that. Also, just generally spacing in like the area that you're trying to fend off. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're, ooh, 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 that's 45. damage and 68. That bike throw, man, it traded, traded off all the damage in the galaxy and throwing away the the, 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 uh, the big hit down throw just so that he can do that. Because could you imagine yeah. if you could down throw the, um, the bike or heavy objects? It would do so much damage. Because in Smash 4, when you threw the bike down, it did 22% on the ground. Oh, my God. Now, now Snorley is just looking for a way in. AJ is just not letting him get in right now. If I air. air. Yeah, there. He has no bike. I would recommend going off stage. And he has bike again. He has bike, yeah. We're having that similar situation. These down smashes aren't working out. Warrior is doing. Is it a warrior thing where he's just really good at grabbing the ledge? Because I get hit by that constantly. What, warrior or the down the smash? down smash. Yeah, warrior grabs the lip of the stage. He doesn't appear, like, on the stage for the character just ex appears on the stage and then disappears and grabs the ledge. You know what I mean? If that makes any sense? Yeah. Like, warrior will always grab the lip of the stage unless you hold down and directly after the up B okay. so you don't pass the ledge because it's warrior. His hands will all, like, his hands are always on the side. So, I guess in a design point, it would make sense. And Ooh. Oh, fourth smash. Oh. Yeah. We all tightened up a little bit right there. I did. Like, oh, here it comes. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah. And With that back are going to not, not gonna clean it. it up. Mm -hmm. It's unfortunate. Yeah. Lucas, even though being a light character. Oh, there we go. That was good on, on Chaco doing exactly what I was mentioning, where he just needs to hold on to the ledge a little mm -hmm. bit longer. There before, we go. Before making his decisions. Galaxy Brain. Now he's get up, now he's getting up attacking. That's always interesting. Mm -hmm. Throwing the PK freeze. Oh, Ooh, he's dead. He did not the know air that. Yep. He did not expect that to happen. So, um, if I'm correct, which I should be, you are. Oh, uh, he's dead at 45 anywhere on stage without rage. Uh, more than likely. More than Unless likely. center stage. Not not talking about like dead at 45, but like if he starts to combo, like right now he's dead. Oh, but that could have been it right yeah, there. Yeah, that could have been it. That last up there. Mm -hmm. But he's going to wait for the true one or wait for the last stock. Yeah. It's Maybe he just wants it for that last stock situation. Yeah. At, at this point, though, whenever War whenever Warriors have Wolf, it's up to them to make their decision and not us. I have no idea when yeah. he'll be able to use it because that's just me. Oh, oh he, he went past it. the ledge, though. Oh, I saw what you were talking about. Mm -hmm. He didn't have to go past the ledge right there. Yeah. Sun. Into Ooh. the sun. Oh, he could have up through him. That probably would have done it. Oh, he went for the high read but didn't get it. Here we go. Eat. Once again, doing a fantastic job conditioning Chaco to... Oh, uh, scramble. Yeah. Ooh, and back here. Do it, Not though. enough. Nope. I would have got And you know what? Up. At these percents, you really have to respect those those uh, freezes. Yeah. Unfortunately, though, like, um, there's freshness to this, so, like, Bite won't kill him. Unless you're at the lip of the stage. But Bite will definitely not kill um, Lucas yet. I think at this point he's looking just to get back on, get a back air, get a forward tilt. That dash attack, though. Or that dash roll. attack, yeah. Okay, yeah. so with max rage, 35. Yeah, right now, don't die. The sun? No, the sun. Wow, yeah. Yeah. Even game? Not really. Um, well, even game in the sense that Chaco could definitely do his 60%, 70% string and then be way, way ahead. Uh, but as far as who can get a kill right now, oh my God, he that's going to fall yeah. on Snorley. And when you're fighting against Warrior, you're not just fighting against Warrior, you're fighting against him and the clock. But right now, the clock isn't, you know, clock ain't working right now. He's got waft. So the clock ain't there. Oh. Oh, he's just doing this now. Oh, this oh yeah, he's <laughs> putting on pressure. Yeah. He's trying to cook. Oh, he's trying to go for anything he can right now. This is the percent that he said we're going in. That he was it. Just let it rip. That yeah. was definitely he it. He could have let it rip, honestly. Oh, mm, do no. Do not agree. Yeah. Don't beat yourself up. I don't blame him, though. Honestly, I think that was a misinput. No. No, he definitely tried oh. to catch the rope snake. <laughs> oh. I know he's your dog, but, like, 
Hey, you, gotta, you gotta call it. I know, I know, I know, I know. But still, like, I thought it was missing foot. Oh, that's gonna do it okay. though. Oh wow! Okay. Whoa, not yet. I am full of garbage. Back air, back air, back air. No more. <laughs> up, up till that's up smash. Into back air. Yeah. Things aren't looking too good for Choco, <gasps> and just it. like that, yeah, that's gonna good be it though. Wow! Choco saying not today. <laughs> My time oh, is but not. He went oh, left he and missed it. He's he so missed mad. It. <laughs> Calm. Good game. And he missed it. I know uh, he's mad. Wow. I'm cringing for Marco right now. 